September is Prostate Cancer Awareness Month, the time to raise awareness about a disease that will impact one in eight men in their lifetime, including former President Joe Biden, who is currently undergoing treatment for the disease. Washington correspondent Stetson Miller explains how one technology is making a big difference in treating it. This month, doctors and health experts are trying to encourage men to get screened for prostate cancer at age 50. The efforts include highlighting how nuclear medicine is being used to make the disease more survivable. Prostate cancer is on the rise globally, but doctors say if it's detected early, it's typically very treatable. We understand that not all prostate cancers are created equally, and some are not so aggressive, and some are very aggressive. And what we want to do is better diagnose early on those aggressive ones and treat them and hopefully cure them. Dr. Richard Wall is a professor of radiology and radiation oncology at Washington University in St. Louis. He's an expert in nuclear medicine, which is a medicine that uses radioactive tracers to diagnose cancers in the body. And what we do with these imaging tests is we first prove that they're, they're accurate versus pathology and we prove that they're better than CT and MRI scans, which we've done and now we have data now showing that outcomes of patients are better. The recent advancements in nuclear medicine have also greatly improved the options for treating cancers. It can be given before chemotherapy, so many patients are now choosing not to get chemotherapy because of the side effects uh, and quality of life issues. Dr. Wall emphasizes the goal is to eventually move from treatment to cure, and until there is a cure, there's still a long way to go. In Washington, I'm Stetson Miller.